so random. Imagine he just does a pool. Alright, so this cop was parked where we were. I knew he was waiting for us. I knew he was waiting for us to leave, so he literally just started following us right now. I knew it, bro. It was so obvious that he was waiting. Literally back there. <laughs> we weren't doing anything. We are just like parked, doing nothing. I wonder if he's gonna pull us all over. Alright, he's behind me now. Let's see if he pulls me over. He did this like super extra like cut. For what, bro? This guy is literally just waiting for us. I don't know what for. So extra, man. Driver pulled to your right. Pull into the mall. Rip. Oh, sh <laughs> Bro, this is so freaking extra. Alright, let's see what he gets me for. I feel like he's gonna give me for exhaust. I my car is catalyst, so he's probably gonna give me for that as well. Pretty much a stay ref. Let's see. Hello, my name is Officer Marquez, Jones yeah, Police going? Department. Do you have your license registration insurance with you? Yes, sir. You know why I'm stopping you today? Uh, no. No, so several reasons. One, you have tinted windows, um, and you have a loud exhaust. Okay. okay. The reason why I was in the area of Parkway is because uh, we had several callers reporting vehicles matching your description doing donuts. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, yeah, I completely yeah. understand. I mean, I don't see all the tire marks there, but we we're just hanging out, taking pictures. Okay, but, but it, it, is, it is reckless driving to be doing donuts, and I, could, I can tow your car. Um, but I'm, I wasn't there to witness it, so I, uh, I can't do that right now unless I want to call the other, the other, uh, the reporting party to uh, do that. Okay. Um, do you have insurance registration for yes, the vehicle? Yes. So I got insurance right here, and then my registration will be in here. I'm gonna grab it. Okay. Vehicle belongs to you. Here you go, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. No, I understand why you guys, you know, do what you do. I, there is some people that are out there that do regular driving and all that, but. Are you still on? Yes, sir. Okay. <clears throat> um, inside the vehicle, is there any weapons and anything that I should know about? Anything like? Yes. No, there's nothing. nothing. Okay. No. Um, while I conduct my enforcement action, is it okay with you if you step out of the vehicle? Okay. Um, what? As you step or before you step out, is it okay if I pat you down for weapons? Yeah. You have any weapons on you? No, I do not. And they might poke me or stick me. No. Okay, I'm gonna try the back of your car, okay? All right. Are you pronounce your last name? Uh, Borges. Borges? Yeah. Um, so like I explained to you, and you, uh, the reason why I was there is because we got a call people were doing donuts, okay? Um, again, matching the description of your vehicles. So obviously uh, it was you guys. I wasn't there to observe that. Um, so therefore I can't take your vehicle, okay? Um, with that being said, just understand that that's reckless driving, okay? Yeah, okay. That's a very dangerous uh, thing to do. Especially right now, people, I mean, you, know, you saw people walking their dogs, people yeah. are, are with their kids riding their bikes. Uh, uh, yeah, when you guys make some mistake, I know I'm pretty sure you guys are good, mm. um, but that's what, what those closed tracks are for, okay? Yeah, um, I understand what you guys deal with with all that, you know. So I'm citing you for two things. I can cite, cite you for a lot, okay? But I'm just gonna, I'm gonna kinda cut you a break, okay? I'm gonna cite you for the window tint and then also the two plates required. They're both fix-it tickets, okay? okay? But there's equipment violation, they're not moving violation, they don't go against your record or anything like that. Okay. Just make sure you get, get it taken care of on or before uh, April 26th of this year. Okay. So go, have you received a ticket before? Are you familiar with the process or no? Yeah, I'm familiar. Okay. How are you signing here in the red box? By you signing, it's not admission of vehicle, okay? So okay. get the items fixed, have an officer sign off on the back of the ticket. 
um, before your court date. That way you can uh, show the judge that you got it taken care of. Okay? Can you get your documents back? Any other questions for me? Um, no. Yeah. Okay. Take Just care and drive okay. safely. Okay. Okay. Have a good night. had three cops bro three of them I don't know why they had to bring so many to me but that was something else <laughs> hold on let me just get out of this area and then I'll go ahead and describe what's going on because I don't know that was pretty crazy all right we're pulling up at Ethan's <laughs> they literally all dipped they were all like following each other but they literally all dipped and ju they just went to Ethan's house bro what the heck <laughs> Oh my it. gosh, bro. I freaking called it too. Camber? No, window tint and plates. No plates? plates. Yeah. Really? It's fucked up. He's like talking about like reckless driving. He's like, oh, I could tow your car right now if I wanted to. For like, what? I don't know. I was just, yeah, just like, I could tow your car right now. Us. Like, you know, we like, I got a call from whoever, like, oh, like doing donuts on like, you know, that intersection over there. I was like, okay. He's like, but he didn't like let we me talk. We wouldn't be there still. <laughs> I know, but he was like, He's like, I'm gonna need you to get out the car. I'm gonna do like a little search something. I forgot what he said, like a search thing. And he like, he like patted me down. Like he made me like freaking go to the back of the car. He was at his car for like, um, I don't even know. Did it was like cop 20 show? minutes. Three of them did. Jeez. Dude, yeah, yeah like three cops. We, three, we just saw cops. Like, they all just, pulled like, up. Yeah. That's why like, we were like, that's why I was like, yo, I'm gonna go to my house just in case. They yeah, get like all one after another pulled up. Came up to me, he's like, yeah, I got a call that um, someone was doing donuts at the intersection that matches your vehicle description. I was like, what? Like, <laughs> I was like saying, I was like, dude, we're just there hanging out. Like, bro, like, if, we, I was like, yeah, I get... if it was like serious, we would have, we wouldn't have been there. Yeah. Like we, and the cops saw us for a while. We would have left a long time ago. Yeah. I told him like, you know, I understand what you guys are doing. Like, I know there's people like that, but like, you know, we're just hanging out. Like, I'd be like, but he didn't I like let videos, me, pictures. he didn't care. Yeah, like, yeah. He didn't, he didn't believe you on. Nah, he didn't let me like, he just like, he just started talking and like, cut me off. Wait, I started getting dog, worried too because like, perfect. bro, he was telling me all these like, like get out of the car, like almost like we're gonna like conduct. Scary, right? He's like, we're gonna conduct our like search something. I don't know, like, bro, all right. Like, but then again, like, he's like, put your hands on the freaking trunk. I was like, <laughs> the heck, bro? We're doing donuts? What? <laughs> that, that's what I was gonna say. Like, even if the other cop was cool though, I, I was mean, talking to the other cop the whole time, uh, bro. Like, they don't trip, dude. If you're like respectful of them, like, that's what I was gonna say. That as always long happens to me. Cool. Like, if anything, he went out of his way and cut Nathan off. Oh yeah, he cut you off too. Just to pull you over. But you were like, we didn't do anything wrong. Um, like he literally followed us like all the way over. Matched there. our description. Just rested drive normally. Matching is like another FRS. Oh. The exact same FRS though once. I mean, I'll take it though over a state ref. <laughs> <Come> on, <laughs> just, just go, just go do donuts right now. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> What a freaking night, guys. <laughs> Made it home with the BRZ. First time getting pulled over in the 2022 BRZ. That was pretty, that was a pretty crazy experience. Yeah, still can't believe it happened, but thankfully it wasn't anything too bad that the cop gave me. All right, guys, I'm not too sure if you guys could hear uh, when I was telling my friends what happened. If you guys saw the previous video of the new wheels for this car, you guys saw that we were getting rollers and taking pictures um, on that one street, you know, just parked on the side. If you guys haven't seen that video, be sure to check it out. But yeah, in the video, you can clearly see that we're just hanging out, just, you know, parked on the side, just taking pictures, you know, just, just hanging out. Uh, he pulled up, you know, we were parked, and then he pulled up, like, kind of hiding off to the side by the stoplight. Um, and he just parked there and honestly, we weren't really thinking much of it because a lot of cops kind of just do that in this area They just kind of like post it up and they just sit there and do whatever But anyways, he stayed there for like 15 minutes and then he moved closer to us like facing us kind of in like um, A way that would make it more easier to like get to us if we leave once he did that like it was kind of I was like, okay, this cop is probably just like onto something like probably waiting for us to leave You know, it's pretty obvious. He had his like 
headlights on, ready to go. So we all get in our cars. As I expected, he started following us. Uh, so I was not in the back. It was actually um, Ethan, Jason, me, and then um, our other friend Nathan behind me. He was following us for a good, you know, a solid five minutes. Um, and then out of nowhere, he cuts Nathan off behind me. He cuts him off and gets behind me. And we were about to pull into this boba spot. You know, we're gonna get boba. Um, and he's like on his freaking, whatever you call that speaker thing on his car. He's like, um, you know, like driver, like pull over to the right, pull into the mall, like don't go in this area. And had to weave through traffic into onto the other side to the shopping mall where he wanted me to go. I'm trying to remember exactly what he said, but you guys saw like he was just like, Oh, a lot of people do donuts in that intersection and it's pretty true you know that intersection has a whole bunch of tire marks um he's like yeah i could take your car right now if i wanted to and i was kind of like okay like <laughs> i didn't do anything um he pretty much like kicked me out of my car and he's like yo i'm gonna search you he like patted me down you know like asked if i had weapons he asked me if i had any weapons on me in the car he did say he got a call for a car doing donuts that matched my vehicle description which is i don't know don't really if I believe don't know if I believe that or not, but yeah, that was freaking crazy. I'm just glad that I sell the car, you know, it was anything too extreme. I also don't know how he got me for a window tint because he never stood in front of my car, which has like super dark. The windshield is tinted like crazy. And my windows on the side were down the whole time, so I'm not too sure how he assumed that my windows were dark. It's completely legal to have tint on the back windows, so that's not an issue. Um, but honestly, I didn't want to fight with him. I was just like, whatever, like, it could be worse. So yeah, no front plate and no window tint. Probably like the number one ticket warning that I always get is my window tint and front plate. But uh, that's just California. But yeah, that was pretty crazy. Um, if you guys found this channel from my previous videos of like getting pulled over and all that, let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, I feel like a lot of you guys came from those videos. I have a few videos that like, went like freaking viral. They got so many views. There was one where I got pulled over at a car meet and they like popped my hood. And then another one where I got pulled over two times in like five minutes. It was crazy. So yeah, let me know down in the comment section below if you guys found this channel from that. Uh, I feel like a lot of you guys came from those videos. But anyways, that's pretty much gonna do it for today's video. Um, I guess the uh, tip for this video is, um, I don't know, it's just be respectful to cops. A lot of people ask me, you know, like, how do I deal with cops, this and that, how many times I get pulled over. Um, and honestly, just show them with respect. If you're gonna be fighting and talking back to the cop, like, don't expect anything but the worst, you know what I mean? Like, just be as respectful as you can. Like, that's what I do. Like, if someone pulls me over, and even if it's just for, like, a dumb reason, I just give them respect, because it's just like, you know, they're doing their job. People have their opinions on cops and whatnot, but, like, at the, at the end of the day, it's, you know your money your car like so don't just don't risk it by just trying to talk back and act smart because they can do whatever they want so you know i give them as much respect as i can you know i call them sir this and that and nine times out of ten it lets me off really well majority of the time i just get like a verbal warning yeah guys that's just my tip if you're ever in this situation just be as respectful as possible you know they're humans too they're just like us uh so you know just show them some respect but anyways if you guys enjoyed this video drop a like and uh, comment down below what you guys think of this little police encounter. Would you have handled it differently or would you would you have been pissed? Or um, I don't know. Just drop it down in the comment section below. I go through like all the comments. I read all the comments. Uh, so I'm curious to see what you guys think of today's video. I'm going to go inside and uh, start editing some videos. I have like two or three to edit. So I have to catch up on a lot. But yeah. That being said, hope you guys have a good one today. Make it a good one. I'll catch y'all later.